Ooh, welcome back, Guardians. My name is Ethan. You guys are awesome, and what is awesome is Bungie have confirmed that there will be a large expansion later on this year, and there is going to be a full Destiny sequel in 2017. Great news for all of us. There isn't much details on this yet, but it's nice to know that we can look forward to something in the future. So, in this week at Bungie, the update that you will see link in the video description which just went live we have Deej talking about various things but mainly it says prior to the holiday break we mentioned a second larger update slated for spring that content release will feature a significant light increase a bunch of new gear to earn and equip and new challenges for pve players seeking some more fun experiences and replayability Beyond that, the team is focused on delivering a large expansion later this year and a full Destiny sequel in 2017. After that, they go on with their regular update talking about matchmaking and trying to make that better and continually making that better. And then some changes that came with the Crimson event. Talking about bounties and the Crimson bounties have replaced the weekly Crucible bounties and the Crimson and Sugary ghost shells will not display when previewed in character inventory. These ghost shells will appear correctly when equipped and summoned in game. The Crimson connection buff granted by Crimson Candy does not stack with weapon telemetries. Crimson Candy is only available during the event. Once the event has ended, they will convert into Rotten Candy. Um, so yeah, that's pretty much the update that they've done. A very small one, but a very specifically amazing one for all of us PvE people and YouTubers and gamers and fans alike. We have hope. We have something coming in the future before the Destiny sequel. I am so happy. Let me know what you think in the comment section below. Hit the like button if you wish to. Subscribe if you haven't already, and I'll see you in the next video. Yeah.